Hello guys, it has been here, back at it again with another video, and today we have a magical chest opening that I got from Battle, also a clan crowd chest, we only got to 5, but, you know, we're looking for some members, this is our clan, hashtag Y, er, yeah, hashtag YROV82, <clears throat> and yeah, so far I got bumped back down to Arena 9, because I was using just a bunch of troll decks, but I'm also excited that I got bumped down, because I want to be bumped down for like the jungle arena because i want to be in it to show you guys like what it actually looks like if you guys are way too high like in the legendary arena or if you know you guys are like i don't know like way lower like or you know like six or something but y'all guys you'll uh, you guys will get there one day or maybe you guys after the season resets you guys can drop a little bit to you know get there but first let's start off with the clan crown chest guys you know this is my first one because I accidentally left the clan instead of opening it. I messed up. Three ice golems. One bowler. One P.E.K.K.A. 88 arrows. 90 barbarians. And 17 inferno towers. That actually scared me. For a second I thought that was going to be a... Uh... Sorry, I got to take a screenshot there. My first ever clan crown chest. But for a second I thought that was going to be a legendary, but... Then I noticed, yeah, I only got a few rares, which is bad, but, yeah, next we got our, I'm just gonna open all the chests, so both golds. Oh, this'll be an epic. Okay. Skeleton army. Next one. Well, hopefully we can get, um, a legendary here, but, doubt it. I don't know what you need to get, let me check here real quick. Three epics and 19 rares. Okay, screenshot of course. Okay, four, four. Thirty arrows, okay. Six wizards. Fifty eight elite barbarians. We're hoping for epics right here. Dang it, so we're not gonna get a uh, legendary, but that's okay. Hoping for oh wait, we can upgrade our fireballs, so that'll be cool, but hoping for I don't know, clone spell. Ah, eh, rage, okay. Gotta take a screenshot. Like, I love the magical chest the most. I don't know. Like, even more maybe than the super magical. 17,000 gold. Let's upgrade that fireball. Level 7. Let's go. So, yeah. We got level 7 fireball. Like, halfway, I think. To, like, level almost. Halfway to level, uh, yeah, 11. <clears throat> but let's do a classic challenge now that everything about our guards is, like, <sighs> tournament standard. Or got bumped down because, you know, level 2 legendaries gets bumped down to level 1. But let's go into the tournament uh, classic challenge. Wow. Well, facing a level 8 isn't the best showing of how this deck goes. But this furnace, it's actually, it gets one fire spirit to the tower every time. What? That's weird. He's got level 9 archers. Wasn't expecting that, but at least it makes it more fair. Oh crap, but of course only has level 7 commons. I'll place a royal giant for a little bit of a distraction. Oh, she has a princess too. Or he, sorry. Jamie. With like, a bunch of E's. <laughs> oh jeez, he forgot about my princess maybe? Took everything out. And then pretty much what you gotta do is get a... Oh, get as many furnaces as you can, and then... Yeah, it just, it's pretty much a chip damage deck. That's what I made it for. But yeah, chip damage is the main factor here. If you can get one fire spirit to the tower, then you're good. You're pretty much golden. Well, let me distract this princess. Hopefully those fire spirits kill it. He's using a cheap mortar deck, but I'll let him slide because he's a lo lower level. He's gonna drop his Garmy or his skeleton army. I got that from Clash on God. He's Skarmy. But see, yeah, Royal Gi Royal Giant does a lot of chip damage. See, it's already down to 909. Even though this is obviously isn't gonna be a three crown win, it's gonna be a win. I hope against a level eight. And then I have the log and the fireball to chip the dent or chip the tower down more. I'm sorry guys, I haven't posted in <clears throat> a little bit. I've been busy with school, but it's been three snow days right now in a row. So 
player. Oh crap, that princess was not good. Yep. And that's why. This isn't gonna be a close match, but whatever. I don't wanna be like a baby and just like chip down chip down his tower with like logs and crap, but so that's why I'm gonna do like what the deck is actually intended to do, like fire spirits and stuff to take down the tower, not logs just to take advantage of his level. Like, but he does have a tournament standard mortar, which is cool. Oh crap, he just freaking put the most loggable thing down. The bad thing is how, like, long it takes to deploy the mortar, then that's gonna be game. I think. That bomber is actually OP. I'll just let that go. I'll put a good game. Level 8 actually doing it out here. Like, I didn't do good, but yeah. Well, I'll keep doing matches and then I'll come back once I get this. So, I'll see you guys in a minute. Okay, guys, I'm back, but it looks like we didn't get far here. Like, I lost a shout out to Myra here requesting a mini P.E.K.K.A. But looks like we got, um, we didn't get that far because I was 5 and 2 raiders. I went to the cutscene and I thought I would at least get another win. But I got a loss here. But that's fine. 17 cards, 480 gold. Not looking forward to, like, anything, but... So we get 480 gold, of course. One Ice Golem, one Valkyrie, and, yeah, 15 Knights. That's about it. But if you guys did enjoy this video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace!